Psalms, Psalms, chapter 3, verse 8. Salvation belongeth unto you, Yahweh Yahweh Thy blessings is upon thy people. Salah. I like to give all prayers and honor and glory to Yah Bashim El Shah, Bashim El Kakadash. Why Yah Bashim El Shah for giving us the apostles and the elders of great millstone who deserves our honors rightfully so. Shalom to the Aki and pushing the words of sincerity and truth and being faith based and being prepared for what is to come. And what is to come. Race force, famine, concentration camps, gone, cried to each other, the mark of the beast. 200 million missiles hitting the soils of America. Simultaneously, the chariots of the Lord lifted up the whole floor into the chambers. Simultaneously, the chariots of the Lord shoot laser beams down godly in the Edens. Let be so. Hey, I brought this out, Lord, to the course of this video. Just a vessel seeking salvation out of this filthy place, girls, you know, in Sodom and Gomorrah, Egypt, Babylon, and all the other filthy customs they have taken upon. Um, just a quick one. Um, I was listening to a video Apostle Cabal was saying. Um, he said, um, you know, yeah, you know, Yahweh Shah is the one coming back to save you. And it stuck out when I, I was so exhausted when I was listening to it. I woke up, I fell asleep, and I'm just waking back up. Time is 5 16 a.m. And, um, today's Tuesday, January 9th, 2023, the hopeful year of Jacob's trouble. And as usual, our apostles has been on point accurate about the prophecies and about everything. See, you could throw um you could you could say what you want. You know, you could you could blame whatever. But when all hell breaks loose, you're gonna blame that on on the apostles. Just remember our um prophets back then that in the scripture speaks about the same ordeals. You know. Like for example, um, this is a uh, um, if I can see it till I find it. Um, because salvation is the key, right? And uh, we understand that Yahweh is not Yahweh is not coming back. Yahweh Shah is coming back. All right, all right. Isaiah chapter sixty-three, verse one: Who is this that cometh from Edom with thy garment, with thy garments from Basra? This is this that is glorious. In his apparel, traveling in the greatness of his strength, that that I speak is righteous, mighty to save. Who is that? You gotta explain. Tell me who that is, buddy. Because if you can't, because it's not you, you know the one that you, you people don't want to claim to worship is the one that's come back to save. He's the mighty one to save. He's the one that's going to make, that's going to give salvation. He's the one that was able to open the book. What do you mean? He did everything. His name is Yahweh Shah. Right? So, I'm just like, you know, I, was, I was exhausted. Let me see what it says in the NLT. All right. Oh. It says the NLT translation. Who is who is this who come from Edom, from the city of Basra? The, the code name for Basra is, is America. With the clothing stained in red. We know that he literally gonna have no, no red on him, but he's gonna be doing some lot of killing. All right. That's what I was shot and the angels with him. Who is this? Who is this royal robe? Who is this in a royal robe? A royal king, man. He's a royalty, bro. A king. He's a royal. He's royal, man. Royalty. Who is this 
in royal robe. He's a king, man. You bow to kings. All right. Marching in a great strength. In his marching in his great strength. It is I, the Lord Yahusha. <laughs> so like it. Announcing your salvation. Announcing your salvation. You ain't gonna get saved, man. This man, the only way you're gonna say if he if he if you repent and you get get on your way on the right track, man. It is the Lord Yahweh Shah. Yahweh El Shah, who has the power to save. And that's it. The royal robe. Yahweh is not coming back. Yahweh Shah is coming back. Yahweh is sending back Yahweh Shah. Yahweh don't even Yahweh Shah don't even know when he's coming back. But he's coming back. He's the one that's coming back with the team. So you gotta get, keep that in mind, man. Like, you know, you might, you know, um, you know, you might pronounce words better than me, man, but you ain't comprehending, man. You might, uh, or you know, might say, you might wear your hat better than me, but you're not comprehending, man. You know, our apostles, your, your, um, the one, your leader, Shikari, right, Alizai, Alizai, right, um, he was, um, under the tutelage of our apostles. You know, I don't see them, hey, why are you worried about if, I, <laughs> hey, it's like it, man, hey, I don't know about, you know, I got I like chocolate with me. Alright. But I'll be damned if I'm not gonna have me some medium bite with me. I'm not I'm gonna have me some more bite with me. I'm gonna have some anime. I'm gonna have some eating moment. I got I seen I seen this fine ass eat on moment, bro. Or I'm like that. I'm claiming that in the kingdom, bro. If I get it on this side, you know, she's gonna have to have no husband. And I can have her. But perfectly in the kingdom, you know, whatever whatever make I don't see you know, whatever we have on this side, in this America, if it don't make it over the chariots with us, it ain't for us. We've been in this truth. I've been in this truth for a long time. I already, I, talk, I caught things that's not with me now is I don't consider the losses. You know, I, I consider it um, loose weight now. I'm not, it, it's not with me now. It's because it was supposed to be with me. And what the Lord provide, provides me now is what he went around me. Just remember, this is Yahweh. You you are in Yahweh. You are in Yahweh on Shah's thing. You're not in your thing. Your thing don't count no more. The thing, the thing of this thing of ours belongs to Yahweh Shemuel Shah. This wonderful thing of ours, the thing that your your um your leader was under our tutelage of our men, the men that's part of Great Millstone. That's why you teach the same doctrine. Got what verse I was going to get. Should have got that first before I started um going to my rant. But uh, let's go back. Right. I was just looking at verses for salvation. You better hope and pray that you want to be part of your salvation, man. Because it belongs to you. Salvation belongs to him. Because when all hell breaks loose, you don't be upset. I hope you're one of those upset that it's called Jacob. Jacob's trouble. The year of Jacob's trouble. Because all your all your charades, people's charades, is about to be uncovered. Now, either you are stone of righteousness or you stubble. Oh, no verse I wanted now. Okay, okay, I got it. It's about to go down, bro. I gotta make this quick. I'm gonna make a part two of this. I just want to get one in before I go into the plantation, because we are still we are still um in um a plantation. Still gotta go to work. Still gotta do this. Gotta do that. I'm not, you know, I can't wait till this nightmare is over. I'm tired of you people talking your shit, man. 
I'm tired of hearing all this shit. You, you, get, you get all shaky when you hear some, just a few words from a man. Yeah, man, we, we you know, what? I, you know, it's some fine. You want to go roll with Umar Johnson, who just want to be with um black queens? <laughs> well, it ain't that type of party because our King Solomon had multiple wives. The reason why he fell off is because he started worshiping, start doing their they, they prayers, they serving their gods. But the Lord didn't say you couldn't have no Edomite woman. Don't let them, just don't marry them. Don't go to bench to her or um, whatever the fuck. <laughs> Stop fucking crying, man, about bullshit, man. Come on, man. You know the damn Edomite women looking good. The more, I, I saw this, I got this, this, this one at my job, this more bite. I know she's a more bite or she, she look, you know, she got this slanted eyes. She looking good. She was looking at me. I come past, you know what I mean? Well, I came, you know what I mean? I'm not trying to approach her or nothing. I'm just saying, though. Go sit your ass down, man. Don't worry about this is bullshit. Man, we're gonna have some concubines, man. Yeah, they're gonna be bringing out, they're gonna be bringing their daughters to have be out to be our um concubines. And they're gonna bring their sons to be our slaves, man. We ain't gonna be working. Yo, bro, listen, I'm not gonna be working no more. <laughs> That's what I'm telling you, bro. All right, let me get to the point. All right, it says. Oh, Yahweh Shah's coming back. He's not coming back as a regular man. All right. All right. This is Isaiah chapter 43, 47, verse 3. Um, thy nakedness shall be uncovered. Yea, thy shame shall be seen. And I will take vengeance. And I will not meet thee as a man. It didn't say, it didn't say Yahweh. It said a man. It, 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 yes, Yahweh Shah. He's coming back. In an angelic force, man. He's going to walk on. He's going to be on top of the chair. He's going to walk on air. He's going to be zapping laser, laser beams at people. Zapping. He's going to be busting people up, man. All types of gloriousness is going to be happening at that moment, man. And you just upset about something, man. You, cause this world is done. This world is over. It's got to go. We can't be two masters on the earth. Ain't going to be no two kings. We ain't going to be. I'm not sharing my throne with no damn doubles. And if if if. You're going to have to come back as Apostle Tahar, Apostle Kabbalah's sons. So you could be trained up. Well, you're going to be, the Spirit of the Lord is going to have his own, the truth in your mind already, but you're going to be ashamed because you're going to be these sons, man. They're going to be, you're going to be ashamed of yourself and you're going to be, you're going to, be, you're going to realize, they're going to say, like, like I said, they're going to pat you on the back and say, it's okay, man. Look, look at it. You got the glorious now. You back in, you got your body back, you got your hairline back, you ain't got to wear a hat no more. You're going to follow the Lord's completely. 100%. So shut your mouth. Alright? Shut your mouth. Shut your mouth. Matter of fact, don't shut your mouth. Keep on talking. Alright? He's coming to do damage. And you're gonna be in a, you'll be you better hope and pray that you're on the right side of this damage. <laughs> you don't wanna be in the damaged part, the rubble part. You wanna be on the part that that that's in the chariots. You know? Oh, Alright, man. Alright, we're gonna end it. We're gonna um, make this quick. Here's another verse. Alright, this is just what I heard. I I never played a part. Um we what, what Gabal, Elder Apostle Elder Apostle Gabal said, but I just, um, he said something and I just thought about that. This is the verse that came to my mind before I fell asleep. This is the verse right here, right? So just to get a point, let's go back. All right, this is what came to my mind. All right, I'm just going to end this, right? And it says, Matthew. I got to go to work. It's 528. I gotta go, I'm fucking tired still. Cause I don't tired of and I want to be saved. I want to be saved. So I ain't got to work no more. Oh, that's why I'm putting this work in, man. I don't see it no other way. Cause the Apostle Apostle Hart said this. He said, "Man, I'm trying to get saved, man. That's why I'm putting this work in, man." And you gotta have faith, man. You worry about um. I didn't hear the whole video what Apostle Paul was saying, but that's that one part, man. I remember we were talking about this before. I think y'all had the same problem with y'all shot coming back to save us. You 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 you, you young gentleman, nice young gentleman, you. Trying to call you out your name. But stop disrespecting my king, man. Yahweh Shah is my king. Alright? 
Matthew, you don't want him to be your king. Uh, you better hope he, you better, you better, you better. I don't know what to tell you, man. Because Yahweh Shah is the one coming. Look what it says. It's Matthew chapter 1, verse 21. She shall bring forth a son, not sons, a son. And through, and though she call, and, and thou shall call his name Yahweh Shah, for he shall save his people from their sins. I need salvation, man. I've been a sinner. All these, whatever whatever lies I was living before, I, was, I know I had to be in sinning. Because I have the water, Yahweh Shem Yahweh had he gave me back the, um, the mind structure to, to know what's going on. I need to be saved. Right? By Yahweh Shah. It makes sense. For a man to go up on a cross and come back down here to um to, for that reason. He was done. He did this from our for our sins. Okay? I don't want to sin no more. I want to be perfect. So and I and I want all my body structure back. And you try to wear in a fitted hat, cover your big head. <laughs> hey, shalom, man. All prayers and honor, glory go to Yahweh Shalom, comfort us. The water of Yahweh Shalom, Shalom, for the most apostles and elders of great millstone. Shalom, shalom to the Aki. Shalom.